Vincent Price, born in 1911, was a prominent American actor, art historian, collector, and gourmet cook. He is best known for his distinctive and spooky voice, which became iconic in a series of horror movies. Price's film career, spanning over six decades, began with a comedy role in 1938 and took off in the horror genre with films like House of Wax in 1953. Apart from acting, Price had a deep passion for art. He was an art enthusiast and advisor, holding a degree in art history, and frequently lectured and wrote books on art. Price's life was cut short on October 25, 1993, when he passed away at the age of 82. His death marked the end of an era, leaving a void in the world of horror films. Join us as we delve into the life and legacy of this remarkable figure. Vincent Price was born on May 27, 1911, in St. Louis, Missouri. He came from a family of inventors and entrepreneurs, but Price's interests leaned towards the arts and academia. His father, Vincent Leonard Price Sarnt, was the president of the National Candy Company, and his mother, Marguerite Cow Price, was a cultured woman who loved music and art. Despite his family's business background, Price's passion for the arts was evident from a young age. He attended Yale University, where he studied English and art history. It was during his time at Yale that Price discovered his love for acting, which he pursued after graduation. Price's professional acting career began in Chicago, where he performed in a stage production of Chicago. He quickly realized that acting was his true calling, and he moved to New York to pursue a career on Broadway. Price's talent and charisma were undeniable, and he soon found success on the stage. In the 1940s, Price made the transition to film, and he quickly became a household name. He appeared in numerous films throughout his career, including Laura, The Song of Bernadette, and House of Wax. Price was known for his distinctive voice and his ability to play both villainous and sympathetic characters. Despite his success in film, Price never forgot his love for the stage. He continued to perform in the theater throughout his career, and he even founded his own repertory company, the Vincent Price Company, in the 1970s. Throughout his life, Price was a passionate supporter of the arts. He was a collector of art and a generous supporter of museums and art institutions. Price's love for the arts extended beyond his own career, and he inspired countless others to pursue their passions in the arts as well. In conclusion, Vincent Price was born into a family of inventors and entrepreneurs, but he was drawn to the arts and academia. He attended Yale University before pursuing acting, which he discovered to be his passion after a stage production in Chicago. Price's talent and charisma were undeniable, and he became a household name in film and on stage. Despite his success, Price never forgot his love for the arts and was a passionate supporter of museums and art institutions throughout his life. Vincent Price, a name synonymous with the horror genre, made his debut in horror cinema with the Film Tower of London in 1939. This marked the start of his successful career in the genre. However, it was his subsequent film, House of Wax in 1953, that truly catapulted him to fame. House of Wax was the second 3D film released by a major Hollywood studio, and Price's chilling performance as a disfigured sculptor seeking revenge left a lasting impression on audiences. His contribution to the horror genre is significant, and his work continues to be cherished by fans to this day. Vincent Price was an accomplished actor, known for more than just his work in horror films. His career spanned various platforms, including commercials, radio shows, and even the popular 1960s Batman series. Price's talent was versatile, and he was able to captivate audiences in a variety of roles. In addition to his work in entertainment, Price was also an avid art enthusiast and advisor. He had a deep appreciation for the arts and spent much of his time and resources supporting and promoting artists and their work. Parts of Price's extensive art collection can be seen in the Vincent Price Art Museum, which serves as a testament to his passion and commitment to the art world. Despite his success in the entertainment and art industries, Price remained humble and approachable. He was known for his kindness and generosity and was highly respected and admired by those who had the privilege of working with him. In conclusion, Vincent Price was a man of many talents and interests and his impact and legacy continue to resonate with people to this day. His contributions to the world of entertainment and the arts are enduring and intriguing, and his story is one that is sure to captivate and inspire for generations to come. Vincent Price was not just an accomplished actor, but also a man of many other talents. He had a great passion for art and was a respected art collector and consultant. 
Price's collection was vast and varied, featuring works from different periods and styles, and he was often called upon to consult on museum exhibitions and acquisitions. In addition to his love for art, Price was also a dedicated gourmand. He wrote several cookbooks and even hosted his own cooking television show, Cooking Pricewise, where he shared his recipes and cooking tips with viewers. His love for food was well known and he often incorporated his culinary skills into his acting roles. Price's versatility extended to his personal life as well. He was known for his supportive relationships and collaborations with other artists, including the filmmaker Tim Burton. The two worked together on several projects, including the films Edward Scissorhands and Mars Attacks, and the stop-motion animated series The Nightmare Before Christmas. In short, Vincent Price was a man of many talents and interests who left a lasting impact on the world of art, food, and film. He was not only a great actor, but also a knowledgeable art collector, a skilled cook, and a supportive collaborator. His legacy continues to inspire and delight audiences and artists to this day. Vincent Price, the renowned actor, was married three times throughout his life. His first marriage was to actress Edith Barrett, with whom he had a son and a daughter. The couple later divorced in 1948. Price then married Mary Grant, a costume designer, and the two were together until her death in 1985. In 1986, Price tied the knot for the third time with Coral Brown, an Australian actress. Their marriage lasted until Price's passing in 1993. In addition to his acting career, Price was also known for his culinary skills. He was an author of several cookbooks, including A Treasury of Great Recipes and Come Into the Kitchen Cook. Price's love for food was passed down to his daughter, Victoria, who was also a cookbook author. Price was an outspoken Democrat and liberal, using his platform to advocate for social issues. He was a strong supporter of the LGBT movement and was an advocate for LGBT rights and AIDS awareness. Price's advocacy and liberal views were often reflected in his personal and professional relationships as he was known to be friends with many prominent LGBT figures in the entertainment industry. In conclusion, Vincent Price was not only a talented actor, but also a loving husband, a skilled cook, and an advocate for social issues. His contributions to the entertainment industry and his advocacy for marginalized communities will always be remembered. Vincent Price, a well-known actor, faced health challenges later in his life. He was diagnosed with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and Parkinson's disease. These conditions affected his ability to perform in physically demanding roles. COPD is a lung disease that makes it hard to breathe, and Parkinson's disease affects movement and coordination. Despite these health issues, Price remained dedicated to his craft and continued acting. His determination allowed him to keep working, even though he could no longer take on roles that required a lot of physical exertion. Rice's dedication and love for acting helped him to overcome his health challenges and continue to entertain audiences. Eventually, his health began to decline further and he made the decision to retire from acting. Although he was no longer working, his contributions to the world of film and theater continued to be celebrated and appreciated. Vincent Price's acting career spanned over six decades, and he became known for his distinctive voice and versatile talent. His health may have declined, but his impact on the entertainment industry remained significant. Vincent Price is synonymous with the horror genre. His legacy in horror cinema is legendary, with his chilling performances defining the genre's villains. Price's talent and influence are evident in films like House of Wax and The Mask of the Red Death, which continue to captivate audiences and inspire filmmakers, including Tim Burton. Price's career in horror spanned several decades, and his impact on the genre is immeasurable. In House of Wax, he played a wax sculptor bent on revenge, delivering a chilling performance that set a new standard for villains. His portrayal of the insane artist with a sinister plot was both menacing and captivating, leaving a lasting impression on audiences. In The Mask of the Red Death, Price played Prince Prospero, a cruel and eccentric nobleman who invites his fellow aristocrats to a masquerade ball while a plague, the Red Death, ravages the countryside. Price's performance showcased his ability to portray complex and nuanced characters, blending charm, menace, and madness in a chilling and unforgettable way. Price's influence extends beyond his own performances. Filmmakers like Tim Burton have cited him as an inspiration and his work has had a lasting impact on the horror genre. Price's ability to bring depth 
and nuance to his roles, even in the midst of horror and terror, has set a new standard for villains and inspired generations of actors and filmmakers. In conclusion, Vincent Price's legacy in horror cinema is undeniable. His performances in films like House of Wax and The Mask of the Red Death have set a new standard for villains and inspired generations of actors and filmmakers. Price's talent and influence continue to resonate in the horror genre, making him a true legend in the world of cinema. Vincent Price was a prominent actor, known for his work in the horror genre. Born in St. Louis, Missouri in 1911, Price developed an early interest in acting and pursued it throughout his life. He studied at Yale University and later at the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art in London. Price's career in film began in the 1930s and he quickly became known for his distinctive voice and striking presence. He appeared in a variety of films, including comedies, dramas, and mysteries. However, it was in the horror genre that Price truly made his mark. Throughout the 1940s, 50s, and 60s, Price became synonymous with horror, appearing in numerous classic films such as The Fly, House of Wax, The Abominable Dr. Fives, and Theater of Blood. His performances were often marked by a delightful blend of menace and camp, making him a fan favorite and a fixture of the genre. But Price's contributions to the arts extended beyond acting. He was an avid art collector, amassing a vast collection of primarily 16th and 17th century European art. He also wrote several books on art and cooking, reflecting his other passions. Furthermore, Price was a social advocate, using his platform to speak out on issues such as arts education and civil rights. He even ran for office in the 1950s, unsuccessfully seeking a seat in the California State Senate. Tragically, Price's life was cut short by lung cancer, and he passed away in 1993. But his legacy lives on through his extensive body of work, his contributions to the arts, and his advocacy for social issues. He remains a beloved figure in the world of horror, and his performances continue to captivate audiences to this day.